Hey guys, day two of my closet declutter. Today we're looking at my closet because my laundry basket is full. I didn't do laundry today because there was a storm. But that means that I'll probably do it tomorrow. And then those clothes that I kept yesterday will be coming in. So I'm a little bit worried because I just really like the current state of my closet. There is still space down here. I'll show you later. But yesterday I kept a white and black shirt because I was thinking that I'll get rid of this shirt which is a plaid one. This one is the generic Christmassy colour I guess is what I think of it as. This one is the red and navy colour. I'm gonna declutter this one. It's a little tiny bit tight around here for me. Oh, I also have this white piece over here that I know is going to my niece. I texted my sis last night and she said okay so this one will go to my sister's daughter. And there is another piece here that I have been that has been on my mind and I think if it has been on my mind I should just get rid of it which is this one here. I love this because it's a very good quality material and my friend gave this to me. It just fits so nicely on and it looks nice because the material is nice but this part here seems to be a little bit too young for me. I had this for a few years and I am getting older so I feel like it no longer works for me. Uh, someone else can enjoy it. I really really love it. But not this part. I'm just doing this a little bit daily. I don't know if I can get it done before the end of the month because that's when I'll probably put a pause on my decluttering. Ah, oh, you can see that there is like a little bit of a hole here. I was so happy yesterday when my husband came out. I was like, look! Uh, when we were on, in the bedroom, I was like, look, do you see that there's a hole? He didn't even notice it. <laughs> wow, thanks. So maybe he'll notice it when all the bags are gone. But let's tackle, I have been stacking some smaller bags on top because I know I have one, two, three very big bags. So let's tackle the small bags today. I moved you to outside my bathroom so I don't have to walk that far for my one and only mirror. And I'm glad that I flipped you over just now to film that clip because I realized that the back cover of my phone has dropped out. <laughs> so now you're kind of balancing on the tripod based on my phone case. So let's hope you don't drop. Okay, so the first bag, it had this white color thing in it, which was why I felt courageous enough to tackle it. As you can tell, it is actually a very nice silky material. It isn't sheer and it has a blue palm tree, which is really funny because this came from my sister and she is not a beach girl. She does not like the sun, nor the outdoors. So I'm decluttering this one because look at the amount of white. Someone else will enjoy it. It's a very nice material, but the color is not it. So far, I have a couple things in my basket. Yeah, probably should not put the white on the black, but let's just do it. <laughs> this piece, I tried on because it says Bali, but it is very tight. It, it, it's not like I cannot wear it, but it is a little bit too tight for me. So I'm going to get this off me. This will probably be good for my niece. I think she might like it because it's similar to the white top that she wanted yesterday. So... This is going to get decluttered to her. This was in the same bag, but I'm going to be keeping this t-shirt because it is a black t-shirt and I love black t-shirts. As you can tell, I hate white stuff, but I love black stuff. So I'm keeping this t-shirt. Now this pair of denim shorts is white color, so that's why I'm decluttering it. I think that my sister gave me this and then I told her, oh, it's white color, I don't want it. I gave it back to her and then... She, every Sunday when we go and meet each other at our parents' house, we always come back with stuff in our bag. So this is one of those that she sneakily passed it back to me. So I'm going to declutter this one because it is white in color and I don't like white clothes. <laughs> I don't know why I tried this on. I didn't zip it up so I'm not going to turn. But I have this exact romper in M size. This one is S size. My sister bought it. And then the M was just like too long for her, but the S was too short for me. So I kept the M. I don't know why she's decluttering this one now. So I'm waiting for my second sis to reply me and see if my niece wants it. But this is for sure getting decluttered since I already have mine in a size that fits better. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to turn because the back has lace and the lace part barely covers anything. <laughs> I had to switch on the AC because it's so hot. Now, this rumble I'm decluttering. There is a burning smell. I don't understand. Is somebody burning incense? Anyway, uh, first up, the color. I was like, oh, I think I'm going to get rid of it. But it's a rumble. Let me just try it on. It is a lot of material here. It's too big here. But it's a little bit like just nice here. I cannot think of anyone who would be able to fit this in my surrounding group. So I'm going to be decluttering this piece. 
excuse me, <laughs> the notification please go away. <laughs> I like it, it's from ASOS, it's a very good material but it's just not fitting me right so very happy so far, I'm only keeping that one piece of black shirt. I'm gonna get rid of this. Most of the pieces that I just show you, they are from my two sisters and I think most of them are from my big sis. I really love this dress, it just fits so nicely and it's so comfortable on but there is some colour bleed to it, like small blue dots. Since I like it enough, I'm gonna give it a shot with my vanish remover and see if it works after one wash. If it doesn't work, then I'll just declutter it because whatever I don't keep is going to get donated anyway. So it's not too late for me to give it to a stranger on the internet before I give myself one shot. So I'm gonna keep this dress. But just know that it might end up getting decluttered because I don't think I will be able to remove the colour run bleeding stain thing. I changed undergarments just for this. Um, it does look like a lot of material here. It is one of those iffy dress, you know, the top just fits so well but the bottom is like you need a right pair of right pair of undies that are like shorts and you need to make sure that you pull down the inside material properly, if not you will crease. I don't know why it's wrong with this but I really do like this. Yeah, okay. No, you still can see a lot of creasing. Like, yeah, if you kind of stand properly, it isn't very creasy but it does, it does look quite formal. I'm gonna just keep it and give it one shot. Like if I don't wear it after a while, then I'll declutter it because it is one of those dresses that you cannot eat a lot in and <laughs> I like to eat. I'm just gonna keep it since I quite like it and I really just want to see if I wear it even once. So let's just keep this and give it a shot. I think I have been forgetting to switch on the light. Maybe you won't even see a difference. Kind of look radar with the light on but Whatever, we shall just use the light. This top, I'm going to declutter. This top never fit me. It's so sad because now it kind of fits me. But I just don't have a use for this. I don't like to wear things that show too much skin, especially the top part. So I'm going to declutter this one. It does have a nice spider webby design. This from Cotton On. Just a tank top, so I'm going to get rid of this. This is a little bit difficult to show you because it is a full length dress. <laughs> it is a long dress all the way to above my ankle. So it's kind of not midi. Here we go. This is also how I look in the bathroom mirror. Which is why when we move, I'm going to have a full size mirror. So it's all the way down to here. I'm very excited that I still can fit in it. This is from my second sis. And it's a fila dress. It has all this like piping. I don't know, one strip down. I don't love brands, but is it because it's fila? That's why it's so comfortable. It is a cold to the touch material that is thick. Uh, that's why I haven't been wearing it to any flights because I've been going to like Bali and Penang and Bangkok. You will die if you walk out of the airport with this. There is also a hood. So I'm pretty excited. It looks like it's very comfortable to sleep in. I'm gonna bring this to... The flight to US, I think that will be when I will actually enjoy this dress. So I'm keeping this. Oh, that reminds me. I wanted to show you just now but I forgot. I want to look at some bags of clothes that's already inside my closet. But it's like, you know, all tied up in a corner. They have all of my travel clothing that are for colder countries. So I'm going to fold this and slip it in the plastic bag there. And then one day we have to look through those. I think I'm going to call this video done. So I kept one, two, and a black t-shirt underneath. So that's the third piece. And this is everything that I'm decluttering. That bag, I'm filling it up for my niece. And then this is everything that I will just post up on Carousel to give away for free. So pretty good. I have definitely considered like fill up the basket today, for today. So I'm happy. I will see you in the next declutter video. It feels like it took me quite long to try on but the clip isn't actually that long so let me add in some declutter here. Oh yeah, I have my Stara here. So that's the white thing that you're seeing. Okay, speaking of white stuff, I looked through the bag and just at a glance I could see like there's also this other white stuff but it's not super white so I will give him a shot and try him on. But these two, they look completely white so... That is a sure declutter for me. I think I should probably explain why I hate white clothing. 
I just like my clothes to service me, you know. And I don't want to like, when I go out, I'm minding. When I go out, I'm eating for sure, okay. <laughs> and I don't want to be minding whether my food splash onto my shirt or where I'm sitting. Like I'm the kind who I don't like to buy branded bags because I put my bags on the floor. Or I open my bag with one hand only because my other hand is always holding something. So I will tap on my bag. <laughs> okay, so this is a white top. It's so cute. I know this is from my friend. This is like totally her style. It's very adorable. If it's black or another color, I would definitely keep it. But it's just too much white going on. It's just a recipe for disaster. That line just pops in my head. So I'm going to have to get rid of it. This is from the brand Groovy. It's in a size M. Oh, what is that? <laughs> so I'm not going to... It has me a ring light. So I'm not going to try this on because I know I will declutter them anyway. So let's just do it today. It is very cute. I really like this kind of baby doll style. Oh, and it isn't sheer, but... <laughs> Let's just get rid of him. <sighs> yeah, you will go here. Okay, let me show you this other white top that I'm decluttering too. This one is like those sheer chiffon -y material. I'm not sure if this is from my friend or my second sis because they kind of have something like this that I feel like I could see. I could picture them wearing. It has all these like cute fat flutter sleeves. <laughs> That almost sounded like a curse word. Okay, anyway, so it's cute. It looks very comfy and lightweight, but I'm gonna get rid of this. There will be some other stranger on the internet that's the total opposite of me that loves white clothing and hate black clothing. So I'm putting them in this plastic for the white stuff to separate them. It's only until tomorrow morning when I'm going to take a photo of it. <laughs> I am overthinking, but I have this fear that they might stain each other because they're all brand new clothing that haven't ever been washed so i don't know whether they will bleed onto each other i don't know so yeah the basket is definitely fuller now now i feel so much better and i can call it a night